Hey, what is up guys? Welcome back. So welcome to another daily video. Um, I have I have this secret project that I want to share with you guys. I think it's gonna be a, it's gonna be pretty fun. Uh, this is this is something I've been secretly working on for a long time. I didn't tell anybody except for my clanmates on Discord. And actually, I think I announced it in, in my MSL channel, so it was, it was like public um, on Discord. But I haven't really been working on like you know the the super evolution and stuff ever since it came out because I've been busy working on something else. Um, I call this you know you know when I back in like last December I made a um, project called Project Sappy where I built like a whole bunch of sappers for Golem Speed um, Golem Speed Ten. I can't even talk right now, but. This project, I think I'm going to name it Project Salty, alright? And it, it's its sole purpose is just to make other people salty. Um, <laughs> alright, so what this is, is it's um, its a PvP project. Um, it's, it's my PvP defense team and offense team. So this is the team I'm currently running on, on my PvP defense. They're, it's four Light Sarahs and one Dark Sarah. They're all level 60. Um, evil 3 and I have them all gemmed up as well um, the thing is like they're not a it's not a hundred percent complete but I kind of don't want to throw any more resources into it especially on some of the gems that aren't exactly like top top tier I really don't want to spend the um, gold upgrading those gems to plus 15 but basically my whole entire Sarah team is um, is on pugilist gems every single one of them are, are on pugilist um, this one's on 100% crit. This one is 95%, very, very close. Uh, my Dark Sarah only has 99% crit, but actually she has pretty good gems. I think these, these are not bad. Um, and with her being dark, it's a little bit harder to, to push 100%. The other two, I think I went with like HP double attack um, or defense double attack. And then like the other one I think is HP double attack. They're not exactly the best gems, but I kind of just gemmed them up. And um, so this is basically just like this, it's it's like a troll side project that I, I wanted to work on. And what I what I do is I put them up as my defense, and I also go and I, I hit people. Because, um, you know when <laughs> when uh, when you do PvP fights, it actually shows that what mo what uh, units use on offense, so they can see like what they kind of lost to for people that check their defenses. I can actually go and I can use this team on offense as well and, and fight some people. It's not exactly the strongest team, but I think if I do actually like upgrade their gems to full, um, they actually might be pretty strong. So I'm just gonna go in with, uh, with a whole bunch of light Saros and we're gonna try to win, all right? We're gonna try our best to win. I think, yeah, one of them only has plus 12. Um, the rest of them have a mix of plus 15 to plus uh, like, Plus 12 to plus 15 gems. And the good thing about like running these Saros is um, since I have them with like one defensive gem, like either defense or, or HP, uh, with the defense lead they're actually relatively tanky. So with aggressors, even like if two dark aggressors hit one of my um, Saros on the first turn, they won't exactly die. But what I usually do is I try to like um, combo some damage on onto whoever th has high threat. I try my best to pugilist on them. If I don't, then I guess it's just really, really bad luck. But the good thing about the Saros is they actually have a very, very hard-hitting second skill. So when they when they do this, it actually does quite a lot of damage. Um, oh dang, it's a dark monkey. My pugilist and proc, sad. Oh wait, I I might have a chance. I might have a chance. I have to kill this John on this turn. Okay, we win. And yeah, that's pretty much it. That's that's what I've been doing. All right, that's what I've been running um, as my as my PvP offense team for a while, and it's pretty damn funny. And and, and it's really, really, really fucking troll. So this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna I'm gonna like try to do more PvP this week, and then try to get to a higher rank. Um, see if I can like, you know, push Heroes 1. Well, I, I probably could push Heroes 1, but I'm not sure if I can do it with this team. I'm gonna try to get as far as I can with this team, and just like, just keep trolling people. And then when the week ends next week, I'll have my rep as a Dark Sarah, and then I'll have like four Light Sarahs as my like PvP offense team that it shows. So it'll, it'll be funny. It'll be pretty damn funny.
I'll be I'll be bathing in salt. Oh man, that was that was uh, that was unfortunate. Come on, pugilist stun. Yes. All right, I think we have a chance to win. Oop, that side one is dead. All right, I should be able to kill the Arthur with this. Then we'll uh, we'll try to kill this Nike before she gets her AOE off. It's gonna take her one more turn. As long as none of my units die, I should be able to kill her on this turn. Oh man, she survived. What? Ooh, this is really bad. I don't have I don't have a lot of resist on these guys. Oh shit! Oh my god, I got stunned. Rip. That was unfortunate. Ah, oh, the Nike got her AOE off. I, I had to kill her before um, before it got the stun off. If I had a lot of their gems like maxed out, I probably would have had enough damage to kill her. But yeah, I'm, I'm kind of out of gold. I don't have I don't have enough gold to upgrade all their gems to max. But I think if I if I did, um, they'd be they'd be doing quite a lot more damage, and also a little bit uh, more tanky as well. I'm gonna try again. I think I can win this. I just need I just need a little bit more luck with my pugilist stuns. Okay, this is actually perfect. She's uh she's almost dead, but not exactly. I I messed that up just now. I I didn't uh, I had to use two to attack the C star. Ooh, that was bad. All right, I I see a I see a horrible pattern. Repeating. Oh, nice. They hit the one that's like, that doesn't have a full bar. And then now I have three with their AoE up. I should be able to kill the Nike with this, I think. Oh, wow. They are, they are really tanky. Okay, I win. Oh, damn. This is so fucking troll. Okay, so the the bad thing about this team is I don't have a lot of resistance on my gems because I have them with all pugilist gems, and they're they're not exactly my best pugilist gems because I use my my better ones for um, my defense units instead of um, instead of offense units. So most of these are just like random throwaway pugilist, pugilist gems. Uh, some of them I, I got to plus fifteen because I had them very very early on, but they're not exactly all that top tier. Hmm, somebody's paying. Whoa, he, this guy's got a light Garuda. Oh, shit. Ooh, that's bad. I need to kill this Garuda this turn. Okay, I stunned him. I'm gonna. I'm actually gonna. I'm gonna try to see if I can pugilist stun this. Oh, that's that's unfortunate. No, they hit the one with the full bar. Come on, stun. Oh man, I didn't stun anything. Hopefully I can stun this. All right, they're they're all gonna target her probably. Oh, nice! They didn't target her. It means I get I get I get a free AOE off. I should have comboed that. My bad. All right, just I need like two of them not to get stunned. Whoa, shit! Ooh, that's th that's the bad thing about this team. I don't have a lot of resistance on them. But I think it is quite funny. <laughs> it's it's got to be the most obnoxious thing. Like when you're fighting me, like I just imagine someone fighting me, and then they they have like four Sarahs just like ganking up up on one guy. You know they they like they like all rush at one guy, and then it like kills their Dark Gatito. I just I just imagine. I imagine that and it makes me so happy.
Okay, how am I going to beat this one? They got a whole bunch of stuns. Um, I want to see if I can kill this Sura in one turn. I, I might be able to do it. There's a there's a risk that the, this guy's gen full tanky. If he is, I'll probably lose this. If he's not, I might have a chance to win. Oh, nice. I stunned the Sura. I'm going to try to stun the Arthur. And hope that Thor doesn't stun me. As long as Thor doesn't stun, um, doesn't shock, I'll be fine. Alright, so... Actually, this is pretty bad. Oh, I was supposed to kill the Arthur. Okay, I have no choice. I have to kill the Arthur. Alright, it's just it's it's just a dark Gatito. I think I'll be fine. Um There's a chance that one of my guys will have a full bar AoE. I can risk it. Hit the Sura now. So that like next turn, if one of them gets their AoE off, I basically kill both the Sura and the Gatito. And win this. If not, if not, I'm pretty fucked. Please. Ooh, not this one. Oh my god. Oh the shit, that was that was unfortunate. That was really unfortunate. Oh wait, I still win this. Damn, this, this shit is so fucking troll. Alright, uh... I was actually expecting the timer to, to have ended by now. But I guess we can... I guess we can uh, we can fight this guy as well. He's got two aggressors and and a water purse, so that's actually a little bit harder for me to fight with all their uh, their really really annoying um, sustain. Actually, I don't have a lot a lot of threat. I don't think the Shiva can wipe me in one turn. I'm actually gonna try to kill the purse really really fast. See if that works. Having like four Sarahs run at one unit is uh... Like it, it looks so cute, look at it. Wait, okay, I might be able to kill the purse with this. Should I risk it? Ooh shit, I forgot to... I forgot to close my Discord, my bad. Oh shit, it's a C-star. Let me try to stun her. Oh, nice! I got a I got a triple pugilist done. Okay, I win this now. This should be able to kill the C star for sure. I think, unless it doesn't crit. I stunned the Shiva, so it can't it can't um, heal or anything. All right, that was that was uh that was pretty funny. Just, just thinking about like the people that like fight me on offense, really gets my jollies up. Okay, what's, what about this one? Um, what should I do? I should probably kill their aggressors first. Ooh, no, no stuns. Oh man, I didn't even kill her. That's that's horrible. Ooh, this is gonna hurt. I don't even know which one's which. I have like one that's like slightly weaker than the, the than all the other ones. Okay, I have like three of them with their AOEs up. I should be able to kill something with this. They just completely melted.
I, I think I might have found the new meta. I, it might work really, really well against the, uh, the full light teams. Because the full light team is built to counter the full dark teams. But if I, I can actually maybe fight some light teams with, with this light team. Ooh, this one, this, this team could be pretty annoying to fight against. Alright, I'm gonna, I'm probably gonna have to kill the Banshee first. And then, um, since I stunned her, I don't need to do anything. I'll try to stun as many as I can. I'll see if I can, uh, stun the purse. Oh, that's, that's unfortunate. Actually, that move was really high risk. I shouldn't have done that. I really shouldn't have done that. Okay, I have two AoEs up. They should focus this one, because she's armor broken. Um, hopefully, this is enough damage to kill the Mihos. Please stun the Miho. Oh, man. That's horrible. Ooh, they're going to heal a whole bunch. I think this will this will kill the Miho. Oh nice, I stunned the two of them. Maybe I can stun the Nightmare with this, or at least kill her, or maybe kill her. <laughs> Man, this, this full Pugilist Battle Rush team is actually pretty OP. I just need to max some of their gems, but I, I'm not sure if I should. I, I should definitely do it for the troll effect. This is just too good. Ooh. You guys found your sister. Time to fuck her up. Wow, she's so tanky. What the hell? All right, this is a full light team. This is what I what I kind of wanted to see if this team could counter. Holy shit, that hurt. That hurt a whole bunch. Stun. 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 Nice. Perfect. Ooh, they landed that shock. But I think it should be fine. See if I can stun this Thor. Alright, they're probably all going to focus this one because it's shocked. But the two of them don't really have any damage, so I think I'm fine for now. Oh nice, I stunned the Nike again. I can kill this Thor. <laughs> kill this Light Suck. This is this is too good, alright? This, <laughs> this is just too good. <laughs> Alright, and we ranked up to Diamond. Um, yeah, I'm gonna... I'm probably gonna try to max out some of their gems. Um, probably not all of them. I'll see which ones are good, which ones aren't. And then I'll upgrade those ones. But I actually do, did make some uh, pretty good Pugilist gems that I got from last week in Dragon. I, I don't have a lot of time to like manual Dragon now, so I've been... Um, I've kind of just been putting it there and like autoing um, dragons B B seven the one the the stage that that drops the square slots and I actually happened to get like a few pretty decent gems I would say like this one uh, it's got it's a HP gem with twenty three percent resist and I think I think I have another one that's like very very similar to this one as well I have an attack gem also with uh, twenty twenty three percent resist. Um, I think I threw another one on one of my Saros. Can it? Wait, where, where is she? I think it was here. No, the, none of these have resist. Maybe, maybe it was her. No, this one's a, this one's a defense one. Yeah, it was, it was this one. This one had 14.5% um, crit. 
and also 23% resist. So these are actually pretty good. I'm gonna I'm gonna start um, gemming some of my other d defense units up with uh, Pugilist. I think I can actually put Light Suck with those two gems, and then use her on defense. And I'll I'll use my Light Shiva. Uh, my Light Shiva is on a triple life set as well. And I can also like if I really need to. Because I'm using like mostly pugilist gems, my resist can't really be like super super high. Um, at most, I think I can only push it to like 60. Like 70 is like really really pushing it. If I can get like a single gem with uh, with 30 something percent resist, like something like this. Wait, not this one. You know, like 30. Like this is this is like four rolls. It's it's really really hard to get these type of gems. Um, but I can get a few three roll gems. And then I can like actually pair them up with like a Wood Nightmare, who has like a 24% resist lead, and then that'll push me to like 85% resist, and I I can I can actually make a pretty um, high resist like full pugilist defense team if I if I do do that. But yeah, that that is that is pretty much it. Um, I have a little bit of gold, but I don't have like I don't I can't summon all my eggs with the amount of gold I have. I'll make some, I can summon two of these, but I can only summon one of these. I can't, I think I should I'll do them all at the same time. All right, well, we'll summon, um, I guess, I guess I can't really summon them all. I'll summon, I'll summon like, until I have a hundred gold left, and then I'll summon my light dark eggs, or a hundred fifty gold left, and I'll summon my light dark eggs, and then we'll come back tomorrow and summon the legendary eggs. Oh nice, we got a Mona. I usually do all my summonings on these like daily videos if I like show my progress or my progression and stuff. Although this is not real progression, it still it still counts. All right. The the most important thing about your PVP defense is not how like how successful it is or uh, you know how like you know how bulletproof it is against like all the different comps that people can run against you on offense the most important thing about your PvP defense is actually how much salt that it generates um, so you know I think I, th I think I win this week I, I definitely do win this week all right we're almost there I'm I'm building up karma. This is this is this is my summoning strategy. I summon a whole bunch of eggs, get no four star, I summon light dark egg, and then boom. Nat five, right there. That's that's what happens. Alright, let's do this. Let's let's pop the light dark eggs. Ooh, it's a dark pen pen. Oh wait, I already I think I already have one of those. Sorry, my, my karma's just building up, alright? It's, it's building up. This this is the lightning right here. This is, this is the light dark nat 5. Man, three pen pens in a row. Alright, I'm out of gold. I would summon them all, but I, I'm out of gold. We'll come back tomorrow, um, or the day after. Um, it'll probably be like the, the clan fest by then. And then I'll summon them all. And now that I'm kind of done with my leveling and that, that troll project, um, I, I'll be able to, I'll be able to start farming some materials, um, cause I, I couldn't use the Saros to farm this stage, they're, they're kind of not really suitable for farming these stages, but I'll, I'll try to find a team that can farm these, um, but that's, that's pretty much it, um, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video, peace out.